Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are doing well today. Thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received more than you will ever know. So what I need for you to do right now is I need for you to give me all that fun, loving, exuberant, beautiful energy that you got. You can do that by clicking that like button. You can comment, you can share, you can subscribe, you can just do all those beautiful, magical mother trucking things that you do to me so well here at Talia's Tarot. So, I'm going to slap down the holy water. Oh, yeah, baby. Storm's getting ready to come in. Ah, so good in the neighborhood. So, Tarot is now in session. The most honorable judge, T.T. T. Dong, presiding. You may all be seated. So, we're going to check in on the energy of the person you're dealing with or whatever energy might be coming towards you, my beautiful loves. Whatever the case is, we're going to get it, we're going to hit it, and we're going to quit that shit together. And then we're going to burn one out in the back. <laughs> Show! Okay. Show! Okay. Show! Show me the end. Okay. What was that? What was that? Okay. Okay. Down on the table, we've got the Ten Cups. We've got Lady Justice for the Gavel Bang. Thank you, Lady Justice. We've got the Two of Cups, the overall energy for the reading is the Queen of Swords. So, somebody here um, is not playing around. It's like they want to have a conversation here. Okay. Ten Cups. Okay. Basically, at the end of the day, you make this person very happy, okay? So, this person here with the Justice card, Justice is a card of, you know, having to go to court, maybe a separation or getting married. Um, it's also a card of, you know, balance, seeking the truth, because Lady Justice, she holds and she welds the sword of truth, and um, yeah, she wants the truth and nothing but the truth, so help you God. Two of Cups, this person's in love with you. So, so many years in love with you. So, let's go ahead. We're going to talk to Lady Justice and see what's going on here with Lady Justice. Why is Lady Justice here in this reading, please? Come on. Why is Lady Justice in this reading, please? Why is Lady Justice in this reading? Okay. 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 So, this person is wanting to successfully give you clarity. And what is this person wanting to give Pisces clarity on? How they feel. Oh boy. Oh boy. And how does this person feel? How does this person feel? Okay. Well, they feel like this connection is very much healing. Okay? That's what's coming through. Lover's card crossing that. So this person here feels very much like this connection is healing. And I feel very strongly that they don't want to ruin things here. So... In order for them not to ruin things, it's like they need to tell you how they feel. Oh, boy. Okay. I can appreciate that. The messages are just coming in fast on this reading. I don't know why they're coming in so fast, but they're coming in fast. So, why is this two of cups here in Pisces person's energy? Come on, top to bottom. Why is this two of cups here? Why are they feeling so much love for the Pisces? Why are they feeling so much love for the Pisces, please? Come on, shuffle truffle. Let's go. Why is this person feeling so much love for the Pisces? Because you make them feel very confident here. Okay. So you make this person feel super confident. And I shuffled that deck and that still lover's card came down at the bottom of the deck. Okay. So why else are they feeling so much love for the Pisces here? Why else are they feeling so much love for the Pisces here? There's that Queen of Swords. Oh boy, Pisces. Did, is it, are you the Queen of Swords here? Did you tell them something here? What's the Queen of Swords here for? The Queen of Swords was the overall energy for the reading and it's back here again. So why is the Queen of Swords here? Okay. You told them something here that has this person worried here. Oh boy. What did you tell, what did Pisces tell this person here that has them worried? Mm hmm. 
Page of Pentacles. Oh boy. So it's what you aren't telling this person that has them so worried. So what is Pisces not telling this person that has them so worried? What is Pisces not telling this person? Okay, there's communication. That's a repeating message. That's a huge sign. Ace of Swords crossing that. So what are they not, what is Pisces not telling this person that has them so worried? What is Pisces not telling this person that has them so worried? What is Pisces telling this, not telling this person that has them so worried? What is Pisces not telling them? The Emperor here. Mmm. Ooh. Are you dealing with somebody else here and this person is worried that you're dealing with somebody else? Is Pisces dealing with somebody else here and that's why they're worried? Oh boy. They feel like you are. They feel like you are. They and Honestly, they feel like you are. And not only that, but they feel like you're very empowered right now. So it's, and here's the thing, it's what you're not telling them that has them so worried. So they're seeing you as somebody that is very powerful and very controlling with their words. So you're not saying anything to this person on really how you're feeling here. Mm-mm. No, you're not. Not at all. And this has got this person all up in their head, big time. Oh boy, Pisces. <laughs> okay, so why is the Ten of Cups here in Pisces person's energy here? Why is this Ten of Cups in Pisces person's energy? I just got a high ring pitch in my ear. That was wild. Oh boy. Okay. So, right now, it's like, you guys aren't together here completely. Are is this person in love with you? Yeah, they're in love with you here. Very much so. Have they told you? I don't know. I don't think they have. I, I, I don't know. They got the feelings of love, but basically because they haven't told you how they feel, you're not telling them how they feel. So you guys are both mirroring each other here. Okay? And now this person, it's like, they're heartbroken here, and they're like, there's a lot of sorrow around this ten cups, because it's like they're, they're wanting these ten cups with you here. Let's go one more here with the three of swords to the ten cups. One more with the three of swords to the ten cups, please. One more with the three of swords to the ten cups, please. Three of swords to the ten cups. What's going on here? Three of swords to the ten cups. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, Pisces. Pisces, this person feels like there is an obstacle here. There's definitely an obstacle here. And one of the obstacles is it's like you're busy with work here. And it's like the other obstacle, this person, it's like they want to come in here. And they want to share some emotions here with you. So what emotions is this person wanting to share with the Pisces, please? What emotions is this person wanting to share? They're like, Pisces, I want to complete something here with you. What does this person want to complete with Pisces? Okay. They want to complete a message. What's this message? What is this message? This message is, is that they want a monogamous relationship. Yep, Nine of Pentacles. They're single, available to pursue, and they want a monogamous relationship here, Pisces. Okay, all right, right on. I can appreciate that. So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to get the white sage cleared off, and then we're going to do one card for each sign. So what else do you want to tell Pisces before I close off this reading, please? What else would you like to tell Pisces before I close off this reading, please? Yeah, they want to tell you how they feel. They're in love with you, Pisces. This person's in love with you. Pisces, this person wants to, they want to build something here together with you. They do. Yep, and it's like they just want things to be real smooth between the two of you here. Okay, I can appreciate that. So we're going to grab the meow meows. Meow meow. And then we'll do one card for each sign. Pisces dealing with Pisces. Pisces, Pisces. They feel a strong soulmate connection to you. Cancer. Cancer. Cancer thinks you're really hot. Scorpio. Scorpio. Scorpio's in love with you. Ooh, this is getting good. Aries. 
Aries, Aries, Aries. You guys are not talking. Uh, Leo. Leo. Ugh. Leo. Leo. Okay. Okay. They feel like everything's been going well between the two of you. Uh, Sagittarius. Saggy, how do you feel about Pisces? Saggy? Sag. Oh, that card went. I gotta get up and get that one. Okay. Okay. Sagittarius is very obsessed with you in a very unhealthy way. Libra. Libra. Libra, Libra, Libra. Okay, they got a lot of fear and anxiety because there's something here that's been taking too long. Uh, Gemini. Gemini. Okay, you guys are not talking. Aquarius. Okay, they're very much guarded against you. Ugh. Virgo. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Um, you guys are not talking, and they have walked away from the situation. Taurus. Taurus, how do you feel about Pisces? Taurus. You make Taurus very happy emotionally. They can see having a, a life with you, a family. Uh, Cappy. Cappy, how do you feel about Pisces? Cappy, 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 Cappy. They want to tell you here that they want to move forward in this connection, okay? So, Pisces, that's been your reading. I hope the sound checked out. Tarot's adjourned.